March 21st, 2021. I believe the Lord woke me up early this morning. Had a dream. I think it involves something happening to someone else, and I stood up to say something Christian about it. Yet someone came along and tried to twist it to fit their own agenda. I wanted to bring a Christian perspective to it. Yet I found myself stopped as this other person was proclaiming their own thing loudly and basically overriding what I was trying to say. The Christian perspective I was trying to bring to it was something about, yet for a good man someone might die. Please pray for discernment over all that I put into this video. Scripture verse, Romans 5, 7-9 through 9. For scarce for a just man will one die, yet perhaps for a good man someone would dare to die. But God commendeth his charity towards us, because when as yet we were sinners according to the time, Christ died for us. Much more therefore being now justified by his blood, shall we be saved from wrath through him. Verse 7 is a verse that I thought of, but I thought I would include the rest of it, because it points also to the gospel. I'm not sure, but I think I'm going to have to do with a gay person trying to fit it to their own end, but I'm not sure. As I contemplate this, I see a rainbow in my head. Someone was definitely trying to fit what I was looking to say to their own agenda. However, that is not what this video is about, nor did I initially intend to start this video with this. What I wanted this video to be about is this. As I was in my kitchen this morning, something came to mind. A gal had put up in her comment section about a prayer. She thinks it's a beautiful prayer. Okay. I was not involved in that conversation, yet a particularly nasty spirit attacked me. I prayed to the Lord about it. This nasty spirit was not what I wanted. Prayed something about people can like what they like. I like a different prayer. I think I said something about people like whatever colors they like. I don't remember if I spoke it out loud or not. It was between 4 and 5 in the morning, and I had woken up just a bit before. But something about the Lord had created us all differently. Two scripture verses initially came to my mind. Philippians 2 verse 4, Each one not considering the things that are his own, but those that are other men's, and lovers of selves. In researching this, I came to 2 Timothy 3 verses 1 through 5. Know this also, that, in the last days shall come dangerous times. Men shall be lovers of themselves, covetous, haughty, proud, blasphemers, disobedient to parents, ungrateful, wicked, without affection, without peace, slanderers, incontinent, unmerciful, without kindness, traitors, stubborn, puffed up, and lovers of pleasure more than of God, having an appearance indeed of godliness, but denying the power thereof. Now these of avoid. Later, as I was writing about this down, this verse came to mind. Love your neighbor. When I went to read the Bible, I was led to Second Peter. After that, I read the letters of John. I encouraged folks to read those. Then I went on to my computer to work on this and another video. Did a bit of time on a comment section on a brother's channel and saw others posting of their physical issues. Vertigo. Headache. For confirmation, you can see Brother Chad from Watchman 88 on the wall on his vid today. Here is the link. I will post it in the About section below. 